production over the course of the game. We certainly are tonight. Uh, guys did very well in all three phases of the game. We obviously contributed. We came out fast on offense when we had the win in the first quarter. And as the game went on, we really had to rely on the defense and the field position to, uh, to keep the game uh, in a situation where we could win it in the end. It certainly did. So very excited about our guys' effort. And uh, feel free to ask these guys some questions. I'm sure have some outstanding answers. No pressure. Tyler, uh, was that... Once, once you guys had that 21-0 that, uh, lead, did you guys feel on defense like, all right, I'll, if you play the way you can play, that that sort of relief was something you, you felt pretty good about your ability to protect? Yeah, you know, we came out hot, very good um, stopping, but we knew they were a great team and we couldn't let up because they could easily get back into the game. So um, we just want to keep doing what we've been doing that was working and keep applying pressure. Emil, uh, can you talk about that first quarter and, and, and the, uh, in the way you guys, the way you guys started today? I mean, that was a big thing for the team. Um, we always focus on coming up fast, and uh, I think today we did that. We did a good job doing that. But um, obviously, we can't uh, let up every day. We just have to, uh, like Tyler said, continue to find pressure. And uh, we have to finish through the fourth quarter. But um, 21 points in the first quarter was a big thing for us. Tom, coming off an injury, was that, was that a satisfying way to start to, to get that to get going the way you did? Yeah, yeah I mean, it, it felt great. And, uh, the past few games, I kind of started off. As sharp as I would like to, and picked it up in the second half. So, I, all week long, I really wanted to make it a big emphasis on myself just to come out you know, ready, ready to go. And uh, you know, I, I felt like like we did that as a team today. Uh, you know, Emil touched on a little bit, a little bit frustrated, like with myself, really, just uh, the way we ended the game. Uh, and Delaware is a good team, and they played a good game. John, looked like you missed some time there with uh, an arm injury. Did you just talk your way back into the game at that point? No, I was, I was a little nick. Uh, I'm fine now. I just had to take a couple of quarters off. But, but I'll be fine. I'll be ready to uh, play my hands for this week. So uh, it's a big one for us to, um, today. And, uh, we, can't get, we can't wait to get back on the practice field for my hands. Um, Tyler, um, how big was it for the uh, for your punter to put you guys, because you had two punts inside the five and kept them? You know, how much did that help the defense out? Uh, tremendous, you know, battle field position we definitely won today. Uh, making them go 95 or 90 yard drives are, you know, be definitely beneficial for the defense. So that was huge. Tyler, can you sense sometimes when you're playing a team? Can you sense it getting frustrated when when, when they're uh, unable to to kind of sustain much against you? Uh, a little bit, you know. We know they like to run the ball, so our emphasis was stop the run this week. I think we're able to do that and force them to pass and um, basically play into our hands today. Kevin, you start off the game with one of the calls to be for, but obviously it paid off both in a good field position, one right down the score. What was your thinking behind that, making that decision? Well, exactly that was uh, defer, take the ball in the second half, and if they chose to take the ball, then fantastic, um, which they you know, probably wouldn't give it to us twice. So we would be able to get the win in the first quarter, and they just you know, kick it down deep, pin them in, and then you know, get your offense a good field position, and, and look to take advantage of the win in the first quarter, and that's what we did. Kevin, this is a great job of taking advantage of that situation. Kevin, is this a tone setting? When you, you hope this is a tone setting win as you go, as you start to stretch into some pretty tough games. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, every game is a tough game. We, you know, every game is a tone setter. I guess where we're at right now, we talked about it last week. But every game is a playoff game for us. We had six playoff games and you know, remaining. This was the sixth. We have five left now. So we're treating each one of them as an individual game, an individual playoff game, to go out and try to win that game and move on to the next round. So. Um, with that kind of mentality, is it a tone setter? Yeah, it got, it got us to the next round and kind of our mentality. So, and, and again, whether it's uh, anytime you come down to Delaware and come my way with a win, I mean, you got to be pleased.